What is the textile industry? Most people relate the textile industry with clothing, but it also accounts for yarn and cloth. The demand in the textile industry has continuously increased. In fact, clothing industry's demand doubled in the last 20 years. With such high demand, companies reacted quickly to produce textiles, often disregarding their environmental impact. As such, textile industry has become one of the highest polluting industries in the world. It accounts for 8% of the world's greenhouse gas emissions and 17 to 20% of the global industrial water pollution. The textile industry's supply chain can be broken down into three stages. First, the agricultural activities where plants are grown to produce natural fibers, followed by the industrial activities that extract and handle the fiber until these arrive to the customers, the endpoint of the supply chain. One of today's most produced fibers is cotton, but a lot of cotton is required to produce one shirt, and the environment is greatly impacted by the cultivation of cotton. For instance, the amount of cotton required to produce a shirt equals on average the amount of water a human drinks in 2.5 years. So what if we can use another natural fiber that will reduce the water, the fertilizer needed, and the pesticides used to produce the same t-shirt? All of these have a major impact on the ecological footprint. Without a more sustainable way of producing garments, we will be hindering the future generations. So our proposal is to move from cotton fiber to hemp fiber. But first, what is industrial hemp? Unlike marijuana, hemp only contains up to 0.3% THC per weight, giving it no psychoactive properties. Hemp is only grown for specific industrial purposes, like textiles, papers, and food. Why hemp? Hemp requires no pesticides because of its biological properties, allowing it to grow way faster than cotton. Besides, cotton requires 2.5 times the amount of water to grow compared to hemp. Lastly, in order to produce one shirt, Hemp only needs one-third of the amount of land than cotton to yield the same amount of fiber, thus lowering the amount of land usage. Our study finds that when compared to cotton, hemp only accounts for two-thirds of the ecological footprint and one-third of the agricultural costs. Therefore, we provide evidence that industrial hemp fiber is a sustainable and economically viable alternative to cotton. So why now? We have recently seen passed the 2018 Farm Bill allowing for industrial hemp to be grown in the U.S. Whereas our study focused on the first stage of textile industry supply chain, that is, the agricultural activities, there is still need for technological advancements and further research down the supply chain to be able to make use of hemp's sustainable properties. Ultimately, it is up to you and the other customers to bring awareness to this alternative and make a change.